So obviously this isn't the workshop. Welcome back. We're at Martin's. Let's see what he's doing. What are you doing? Cleaning. Cleaning. That. <sighs> it's one of them. So all that's gone together. There. And we didn't record any of it. None of that, no. No. After everybody waited. Yeah. Well, it was warm when we did most of it, wasn't it? Does it work? Yet to be confirmed. It's got a broken fin there. And there. Cheap cylinder. Those gloves don't look very thick. Well, they're thicker than the other ones, aren't they? Yeah, it's not happening, is it? Of course it is. It's not happening, is it? Of course it is. Not happening, really. I can't always see what you're doing here. Oh, come on, there any. Okay, little springs. It's like yeah. a biro, isn't it? Yeah. CTM has a five plate clutch, you have to press them even further. It's not happening, is it? Yeah, of course it is. It's not happening, is it? You need a tool. I think I could tool for that. No. Probably would have made the tool by now. No, we're going to get this. No, you're not. We're going to get it. You're not going to get that. We're going to get it. It's not happening. We're going to get it. It's not happening. It's coming, it's here, coming. It's not going. It's coming. It's not going, though, is it? This is bringing you nowhere near <laughs> done, actually. No. No. Well, I mean. No. Sort of um, almost, wasn't it? No. No. Nowhere near? Nowhere near. Okay. You gonna make it all now? Might do. Okay. I'll wait for you to make it all then. Okay. You got your special tool? I've got my special tool. I'm not looking forward to the next bit though. What's the next bit? Um, it's compressing springs. I didn't enjoy it last time. It's really easy. You drop that on, don't you? Just pop. And put in springs in. Like that. And then just just do them. Up. Just yeah. You just you just yeah. Oh, oh it hasn't got you. Oh, have you just ruined that first thread? Now? Yeah, yeah. I okay. think what I need to do is it's going to be a sort of a double. Oh. Just like that, mate. It's easy, isn't it? We go all the way with that one, or should we go no, back to No, no, you won't. Yeah. Get him off there. Get off. Next. I don't like to admit it, but you've done something I didn't. I couldn't achieve. Use these springs? Yeah. Because you didn't have a special tool. I didn't have a special tool. I bought them for my birthday, you know. <laughs> Turns out, didn't need them. Just never slipped the clutch. Well, obviously, with all the power this is going to have, you know. Well, I mean, it has got a... Uh, Rocky camshaft, hasn't it? Got a ridiculously high lift looking cam and a high compression piston. And one bar, one clutch spring. And one clutch spring. And um a crank bearing's gonna last for five minutes. So I'm waiting for that one um because uh, I'm sure I said you need to replace that main No, it's gonna be fine. This one that chosen to go that spanner's just gonna get in your way. It probably is, yeah, actually. It's not gonna work for me. I mean, are you doing it or what? Because I mean you just seem to be getting closer to it. I know I know <laughs> you're fond, but all you seem to want to do is just get closer to me. That's basically what's going on, yeah. I mean if I had my hand free rather than holding this camera. It'd probably be more help, yeah. Yeah. I'd probably stop this engine from sliding I think I need to loosen off the other one a bit, you know. Oh why? That's a brave move, isn't it? 
Or well, maybe I'll go for this one next. That oh, might be oh, under oh, a little oh, bit oh, less. Oh, is that what you're going to go for? Yeah. Okay. Is that, is Change that... of approach. Sorry, because the threads are really good in them things. Is he on? No, I need gloves. Oh, you sound like you're at the point where you're going to lose the temper with it. No, 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 no. no. Oh. Red mist descending. No, it's fine. You sure about that? Yeah, it's fine. I mean, it does sound like it. It's quite interesting. On video, you probably sound really posh. I don't. With me being on there. Well, maybe, yeah. The, the comparison. The comparison. I doubt it. What would your old boss say right now? <laughs> I, um, I dare not say. I dare not say. <laughs> really? Okay. Depends on which one. Yeah. Come on! <laughs> Come on! Same one. When do you think I've that done? You sound a bit out of breath, actually. What's going on? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's quite hard work. Is it age? It is age. Yeah. Right. So it was easier doing it on this bench with the wall, though. Uh -huh. It's made it easier. Yeah, we did a lot of detail in this build in the prep. That video did really well, and then we've just kind of done loads of it without filming any of it. Yeah. Here we are. And now the engines together. A bit like a magic trick, isn't it? Ta-da! Ta-da! Done it. Honest. Right, they're all on, look. Okay. Do they have a uh, torque fix? No, but you have to set them to a distance from that face. Okay. It'll tell you in that book. Secret stash? Hmm? <laughs> Messy up here, don't What's that? Here. Hmm? What's that? Spare one. What's that for? Stuff. What's that for? This. That. That. What's that for? You know. Stuff. What's it for? Stuff. What's it for? Stuff. Do you know when we thought that seat was immaculate? Yeah, we did, didn't we? It's quite not, is it? Well, I don't know, maybe. It probably somewhere is. Somewhere under there. Yeah, somewhere under there. Where did they fall? I don't know. That thing goes through that bar, doesn't it? Which bit? That drops on there, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, it does, doesn't it? Somewhere. I don't know what they bolt through then. No man's land. The engine's in. Can you take it down the block? Yeah, it's good. But I'm after one of them. Because you'll notice that that one is significantly better than the one yeah. fitted. Because I wouldn't fit the best one. Well, no. So that's the You wouldn't fit the best to anything of no. yours. That's why it'll stay up there, because you'll never fit it. That's the best you'll say it's too good. But you won't fit it. I want to bend it. It's too good. You'll straighten the other one. <laughs> no. You will. You'll have a blowtorch and soap out. <laughs> I need that. Look at that. That's lovely, isn't it? I need. I, I need. That's really nice. I though. need. I have needs, Martin. Oh, that looks like it. That could that's be the it. one, I think. Yeah. That one with the more coarse thread on. Yeah, I think that's the one. Still needs cutting down, I think. So I'm just recording this as a bit of an interlude. At that given point, I uh, left Martin to his own devices and came home. Uh, and he just carried on putting the bike together. He did relent though, and I did get. The Mudguard, uh, which is for a project which you will have heard snippets of and whatnot in this video, but you haven't seen yet, so I'm not going to show you. Uh, but Martin carried on, he uh, he filmed a few bits and sent them to me, and then it got very interesting. So, yeah, uh, if you haven't done so already, click like, subscribe, all the good stuff, and uh, let's get back to it. Right, I got that set up there. Um, there's a few different ways of sticking that on and getting it set up. I use a bit of household electrical cable for that because then you can adjust it easily because it's fairly bendy for your pointer. Um, and to get that in place, you could, if you've got some strong magnets, you could use that. Uh, if you've got extra thread sticking out, you can put another nut on, but I just super glue it and then pull it off afterwards. Um, so once you've got it roughly in the right place, then rock it backwards and forwards with the DTI in there until you've got it exactly set to TDC, so that is spot on now. Um, 
And now I need to remember why exactly I've just done that. Since I've been over at Martin's and we've put that engine together, it's in the frame. Um, he's been dabbling with it. Uh, and then he got the Boyer Micro Power Ignition Kit out of the box. Did a, a quick temporary loom up, much like I did on the... Uh... No joy, no sparks. Um, so we did a few few tests back and forth, um, none of which was filmed, obviously. And basically I gave him the ignition kit that used to be on the uh, BSA CCM special, the old uh, Micro 3. And he's rigged that up with another coil, so we know the rotor plate is all working. Uh, and he's got ignition now, um, so he's in talks with Boyer about they got a five year warranty on them and stuff. Turns out it, it must just be a dud CDR unit, so we're waiting to get word from them to just send it back and it'll be replaced. But in the meanwhile, he's got my old ignition kit wired up to the bike. Uh, he's primed the pump, he's been on the phone a couple of times, um, and he's now at the point where he's kicked it through with just bit of mist spray down the port and he got a bit of a bark and you know like it wants to go so now I'm waiting for a call back from him and he's gonna rig up a fuel tank of some description it's all a bit Heath Robinson but will the 1959 C15 that hasn't run in 20 plus years start who knows he's very trepidatious about it it's a big high compression motor now. Um, not sure how long it's going to last because it's very stressed, but it should be a bundle of fun, especially with those brakes. Uh, but as soon as he calls, I'm going to start the camera again. So, yeah, stick with us. Where's the thing to turn the camera around? Right. I ain't got a thing to turn the camera around. Where is it then? We have ignition. Where's no? Ah. Oh, there you go. Ah. I don't. Hello. There you go. That, Is your phone? Are you ready? That fuel tank's in the wrong place. Fuel tank's in the wrong place. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> Might be too much fuel. It's filled or something. Yeah, it might do. Mm. I like your kickstart this time. <laughs> your fucking thing <laughs> fell off. Don't need that. Uh, maybe too much fuel there. Perhaps a bit of throttle could. Have you got a throttle? Yeah. Mm. I think I tickled it and it, it probably over tickled it. Yeah, that's bloody it won't start for weeks. Ah, uh, he's off the fuel. <laughs> drunk. <laughs> yeah, my device drunk. Just not going. This is exactly how mine was though. You might have to mark the dizzy and under the clamp and just turn it a fraction each way. Well, I got a bulb, didn't I? Before we um. Before you flooded it. Before we put attach the fuel, yeah. I'll turn off the petrol a minute just in case it's uh. Flooding, although it's not dribbling out, so I don't think it's flooding, flooding. I hear the point. You try kicking it with the throttle wide open? No, that's the next step. Just making sure all my electrics are still electrical. No resistance, it'd give a nice kick back then, wouldn't it? You know where A&E is, don't you, Derek? <laughs> you should have seen that play. <laughs> he nearly said part of his mini. I have a feeling that the earth wasn't quite on the coil. <laughs> it's on now. Oh. Uh, let me. Uh... Okay, I'm going to go take this. No, no, no. no, no, no. <laughs> this is how Martin died. <laughs> and I'm videoing it. <laughs> You're taking a lot of joy in that. I'm not sure. It should get you. Good content, Joe. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's good that he's put the petrol tank right where the flames come out, isn't it? <laughs> the flames come lower, it's fine. Right. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. 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 <laughs> no. He knows what's going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't oh, too much. Oh, the smell of petrol. 
It might be another flame. <laughs> yeah. Can you light a cigarette? Yeah, go for it, mate. <laughs> Just hold it there and it'll... <laughs> ay, 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 ay. Coward. You're kicking that lava Montessa. Yeah, I'm scared of the fucker. <laughs> now you got to mean it, Martin. Bit of throttle. I wouldn't bother with the throttle with a spot of gas that I can smell. <laughs> well, I want to get air in and not petrol. Is it running yet? Can you tell? <laughs> How long is it now? I'll kick it like you mean it. Get out of it! <laughs> Terminal falling off the battery. I think you may need a more uh, robust <laughs> wiring system. <coughs> There's a lack of spark, I think. That's the problem, isn't it? Right, let me get it over centre again in case it's going to go this time. That's lovely, that missing tooth, isn't it? I like it. <laughs> Oh, oh my. my.